Jesus. They are holding presidential elections, they are holding parliamentary elections, they are holding uh, local uh, government elections all over West Africa. So the infrastructure for holding elections are there. Mm-hmm. Uh, the, the, the capacity to demarcate boundaries and to allocations is also there. What the budget, the budget allocation that uh, uh, ECOWAS gives to the parliament, I believe, is sufficient to maintain uh, members of parliament if, if the resources are well managed. So the only thing that is lacking is just the political will. Uh, you know, they declare, but when it comes to actual implementation, there doesn't seem to be any real push by the leadership of the parliament to get this thing done. Because the MP seem to enjoy it this way. Because uh, the, the real the real issue is that as it is now, most almost all uh, equals the MPs also happen to be members of parliament in their various countries. Mm-hmm. A new arrangement where MPs will be directly elected mm. will mean that you cannot be a member of your national assembly and at the same time be a member of the ECOWAS parliament. Mm. So most likely all existing ECOWAS members of parliament may be swept out of that parliament. Mm. And definitely they don't want that. Mm. You know, they don't want that. So the will among the current MPs, because of the, the presidents and what they have expressed their commitment, mm. but the will among the present leadership of the, the parliament to actually, you know, take the step, mm. which is effectively to liquidate themselves and then create a new institution in which they are likely not to even be members, mm. is, is what is needed. Mm. And you talk and you see that, you know, they are just not ready for that. Mm. But would there be that opportunity to really push uh, for us to really get there if they are not ready for that? It's not up to them. The heads of state, the heads of states are determined and then they take it up. Uh, it will happen. But if the heads of states are making the pronouncement and thinking that the leadership of the parliament will take it up, most likely it won't happen. Um, perhaps on this topic, I just want to find out from you, can uh, maybe a member of parliament uh, in the community parliament test this issue in the community courts? Why not? They can test it. Mm-hmm. Uh, parliament, not just a member of parliament, any citizen of the community can test it. Mm-hmm. All 